Norwich City welcomed members of the media to Carroll Road on Wednesday as the club unveiled the state of its accounts following the end of its financial year on June the 30th. The news was overwhelmingly positive and Chief Executive David McNally, alongside Chairman Alan Bokett, told the media that the club has taken another step forward towards arguably the most solid financial footing in Norwich City history. We're really pleased that the numbers look good. Um, when we embarked upon a turnaround plan four years ago, we looked at football, of course, we needed to improve on the pitch, but we also, alongside that, needed to improve our financial position. And after four years, it's great to say that we're now institutionally debt-free. Well, as you know, we try and run the club as a mutual, which means that uh, we'd like to be profitable, uh, but not too profitable, and invest all spare resources into the football team. Uh, in the previous year, before the current financial year that we're reporting on, uh, we made about a 13.6 million operating profit. And that was key for us to be able to pay down all our external bank debt. Uh, so the club is now externally debt free, which is imp vitally important for our future. Consecutive seasons in the Premier League have allowed City's business to grow rapidly. But what did the numbers in today's accounts briefing really reveal? Well, 2013 saw the club's revenue figures grow by over £4 million. The club posted a year-end profit of half a million pounds. And notably, external debt was reduced from over £11.3 million to a figure of just £900,000. But perhaps the number that is most indicative of the club's current prosperity is that over £26 million was used in the last year to pay down debt and also to invest in City's most high-profile playing squad in recent memory. But even after City's remarkable rise to the Premier League and two successful seasons in the top flight, David McNally is still crystal clear in his future vision for the club. Norwich City must continue to improve where it matters the most, on the pitch. We think we're going to continue to improve on the pitch and the numbers will stay solid. I mean, the, the aim here really isn't to produce lots and lots of profit. Um, profit is important and I know it's linked, but the most important thing is cash. You know, it's about generating the cash so that we can reinvest the cash in footballers. Simple as that, really. City supporters can view a full set of the club's yearly accounts online at canaries.co.uk.